Hey guys, what's going on? It's Kodiak here, and I just wanted to clear up some confusion around the 7.2 timeline. When things are coming out, when you can expect all of this new content. And there was a post by one of the community managers today on March 29th that explained all of these things, but I wanted to lay it out for you guys in a quick video so I could get you guys on the same page with Blizzard, and we could all move on and be happy. So obviously 7.2 released, some of the Broken Shore content came out, the scenario, the unlocked your artifact abilities uh, and your new artifact traits. The new dungeon came out. No new raid, obviously. That's going to come much later. But let's talk about some of the things that are coming in the upcoming weeks. So week two, Legion Assaults begin. Now, we talked a lot about a Legion Assaults. They are the kind of Rift-style invasions that'll happen across the Broken Shores. Those will start next week. You'll also see the first PvP brawls become available. Now, brawling is nothing new in the Blizzard universe. Overwatch has it. Heroes of the Storm has it. I'm pretty sure Hearthstone has it. Somebody would have to check that one for me. But those are starting next week. Very excited about those. Maybe it'll get a lot of people back into the PvP world or maybe allow people to dip their toes in for the first time. Now, the following week, week three, chapter five of the Class Order Hall campaign unlocks. And these activate the new followers, the new Order Hall upgrades, and the class-specific world quests. And now this is pivotal to unlocking your class mounts. Now, in the following weeks, weeks four to 11, those story pieces are going to unlock. And that's eventually going to lead to the Tomb of Sargeras raid being opening, uh, being opened, and the uh, ability to earn your class mounts. So you have a long stretch of time it's called a rollout for a reason. Now, there is some overarching things about the story in 7.2. Obviously, we're returning to the Broken Shore for the vengeance, and we're responding to the Legion's invasion, but the Tomb of Sargeras is the peak of that. It's the pinnacle of that, and we will get back in there after we go through all of these things. The Broken Shore scenarios, the Legion assaults, unlocking and completing the next stage of our Class Order Hall campaigns. But we are going to get there. You just have to be patient. So that is the timeline to 7-2, guys. We'd love to help you out here in Exile Power. If you do have any questions or comments, please leave them in the description below. If this is your first time on the channel, welcome. Please give us a like and a subscribe. But for now, my name is Kodiak, Raid Leader for Exile Power, and we will see you next time.